As a kid, you learn all about the cool and awesome parts of space exploration, about moonwalks and docking with the Soviets and the harrowing tale of Apollo 13. But for some reason, you don't hear nearly as much about going to the bathroom in space. Actually, Henry, I can tell you about it. This right here is the Apollo 16 command module, and I'm gonna tell you how they pooped in space. I'm at the US Space and Rocket Center, and this is a fecal collection assembly. It's basically a plastic bag that the astronauts would take to their butt. All right, so number two, in a cramped, sealed command module with two other guys. Sounds like fun. But what about number one? Well, the urine transfer system was basically a rubbery condom attached to a metal tube, which you could either connect to a bag or through a differential pressure valve in the wall of the command module so you could pee directly into space. So this is what hooks you up to space. This. All you have protecting you is this valve U valve outer space. Just think about that for a second. <laughs> I think I might pass, which is actually what that yellow bag is for. So you can pee first and dump it into space later. That port is where the urine came out. And if you think about it, anything you're throwing off your spacecraft is gonna change the trajectory of your spacecraft. In the case of a few hundred milliliters of urine and a 45,000 kilogram spacecraft, you might only change the velocity of the craft by a few hundredths of a kilometer per hour. But over a three day trip to the moon, that's enough that you have to let mission control know when you stop to use the facilities. And once you're on the moon collecting moon rocks, well, the lunar module's ascent stage only has enough fuel to carry a few hundred pounds of extra weight. So here's my question. If I had the option of taking my poop and put it in this bag, would I rather bring this back in the ascent stage or a moon rock? The choice is clear. At least it was to the Apollo astronauts. In jettison bags like this one, the astronauts left a lot of stuff on the moon. Drills and batteries and food containers and towels and cameras and moon boots and there it is, poop. There are no two ways about it. When the astronauts headed home to Earth, they left their poop on the moon. By the way, NASA has the space toilet figured out at this point, so let's move away from this bathroom humor. Actually, Henry, are you cool with me hanging out with some of your viewers in the bathroom for a little bit longer? Okay, cool. So if you would, come over to my channel called Smarter Every Day. I'm gonna explain an experiment that's still on the moon that I only think about when I go to the bathroom. It still works, too. You guys wanna come? Come on, click here. This was filmed on the actual moon. That's where we are, we're on the moon right we're now. We're on the moon right now. It rained earlier today on the moon. <laughs> so we are breaking the seal on a 60 year old urine transfer bag. They keep it here at the museum at the US Space and Rocket Center. No way. This is like the most intimate piece. It's made by Whirlpool. <laughs> 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 that 